Hey, welcome back, viewers, to Let's Play Sly Cooper and the Devious Raccoonus. Brought to you by YouTube and GameAnyone.com. So here we are, and uh, of course I'm Game Age, joined once again by my friend, Unlucky. And we are off to the second part of Tides of Terror. Just have to head over there first. I want to learn how to throw keys like that. It's kind of the greatest thing ever. In case you didn't have enough coins. No, here's the thing though, is honestly, is we did all five keys in the first area. Astonishing! All my calculations led me to believe you had failed to knock out that That's generator. Where you're wrong. Never was good at math. Well, here's a real test for you. I found a way out to Raleigh's hideout, but unfortunately, it is doomed to failure. You're not gonna tell me I have to shoot myself out of it's that It's doomed to I'm fun. Already, that's the only way. Now you're talking. You're really scaring me, man. Anyway, to get inside that thing, you had to steal all seven of Raleigh's treasure keys. So what are we waiting for? You show me those hollow what's-its? You mean my holographic markers? Yeah, yeah. And I'll swipe whatever it takes to get shot out of that cannon and steal back my family's devious raccoonus. Anyways, there's three areas, uh, three levels left before the boss. Uh, yes, the submarine and then the two keys. Submarine has a key. Oh, the submarine does? Yeah. Oh, yeah, so there's only two areas left then, viewers. And then the boss. Now, there's two more lives that are available in this uh, this section. You see the one right there, and we just passed the other one, and we're beginning about to uh, head to the area for the second life. This was a little trickier, and you can end up hurting yourself. Like that. But honestly, they give you the horseshoes, and you can always go back to get them. So, there's really no hassle. Now, there are no bottles in this upcoming section, but here we are. We're going to go to Treasure in the Depths. Now this this one's a little different uh, in comparison to the rest of the style. It's well, you'll see. It's pretty self-explanatory. You found it, Sly. This is where Raleigh's gang of crabs stashes his sunken treasure. Use your sub to blast them. The left analog stick controls the sub. Give it a try. Right. Use the right analog stick to fire its gun. Uh huh. That's it. Remember. You can always drive the sub in one direction while firing in another. To earn a treasure key, you'll need to collect all 40 chests. Do not let a crab take one into a tube. Now here's what I find interesting. Why cannot Sly, clearly in a submarine, not just take key and go, like doesn't matter? Not on your left, on your left. Thank you. Not your right. Now you just this one uh, is a little trickier. It seems pretty simple at first, and it uh, it's, it's fairly simple throughout. But because uh, as the level progresses, if you don't have an eye on everything, the game just is super unforgiving. And you know, so it does. I remember the first time we recorded it, it takes it took us a few tries. I was level playing. However, yeah, this time around, it's actually unlucky who's playing, and that's just kind of how it turned out. So. You also want to make it by this Exactly, so that's just how it turned out. And that's the story I'm going with. Now, um, you can get actually pretty lucky and have like all of the chests fall like basically into one side. But uh, more more often than not, it's that's not it like never happens. Uh, when it does, you're pretty much set because you can keep an eye on it. But uh, you know, it's a little tough. I think it's a really cool level design, and uh, I wholeheartedly support it. I like it, but it is it does get difficult towards the end. Kind of like right there. So, you know what guys, we're going to have to end up using some of our lives, but honestly, they kind of just hand them out, so... Yeah, sit back and watch the failure. Basically. So how are you guys doing anyways, you know? Uh, I haven't been getting a lot of views on the videos, but uh, honestly, it's a little tough, especially because of, you know, our previous recording schedule, which is all hectic and it was everywhere. But, uh, you know, hopefully we're trying to get into something a little bit more uh, steady. Something more regular. Uh, the other website that we use requires us to update once a week. Like, at least once every two weeks. At least once every two weeks. So, you know, honestly, that'll keep us going, at least. Even if we can't record videos, necessarily. But, you know... 
thinking maybe if we don't have, if we just don't have that time to do a full like video update one week, maybe we should do like a game review, like what we think of a game that's just recently come out. Mm. That's that's like a slippery slope that we could fall down, and I really don't. Ooh, that was close. That, that was definitely close. Yeah, you got one in your left. Thank you. Yeah, it's more about clearing more like the crabs than it is the chests more, more, more oh, often than not. Oh, man. Well, I actually encounter one of yours. Uh, better luck next time? I didn't even see, like... I'm sorry, the way we're recording this is we're fairly close to the television. Yeah. So it's a little tough. If we miss something that's just, like, plainly on screen... Slap us in the face via the internet. Yeah. And you, me, you know it's possible. Also, another thing that is interesting about this level is if you get the good fortune to just have one land on your head, no crab will actually be able to take it. No crab will be able to take it because you'll juggle it, essentially. Um, so you can actually kind of try and plan that out, as weird as that sounds. Uh, you know, some, but more, yeah, as Unlucky just said, you just have to just be in the right place at the right time. And hope that that is one of the only chests that you need to guard. That you need to guard. Because, like, right now, once it's hit that, this point, like, the game stops loving you. The, well, this level stops loving you. Yeah. No. I remember the first boss taking us a while. And you know what? We're actually reaching fairly close to the end of this level as long as we can keep it up. Yeah, I to now, uh, the thing is, the thing with this one, though, is, is that, uh, oh, we're down to the final four. Yeah, we're actually getting pretty close. Yeah, we got it. Yeah, okay. Congratulations, you I was gonna it. say, I thought I had that. And that makes key number six. Yep. We are actually seven minutes in. So, you we're gonna go... last level? Uh, Make you know, yeah, let's just do it, last level. Here. Okay. There you go. Okay, so right now we just switched controls to actually myself who's playing. Gotta get... I gotta get used to this whole up close thing. Uh, it's really bugging me. Uh, yeah. It's definitely unnerving at points. Uh, you see what I mean? Okay, I dislike the roll, I prefer dive. Okay, I know it's up there, just give me a minute. Are you gonna go get the horseshoe? Uh, I'm thinking about it. I know I'm gonna actually get the extra life that's up here, I don't... I already have one horseshoe. I think I can make do. Probably. Oh, oh. press select. Mine. Oh, sorry. Start. Why? Oh, we've got 15 points. I was just checking on our coin count. Oh, okay. I was, I was gonna like... say. I was gonna say if we were close to that hundred, you should really get. The, you should really go get the horseshoe. Well, for so the extra that coins will turn into light. But since we're not close, it's like. Why bother? Why? Oops. Oh my game. I'm sorry, guys. Like I said, it's just, uh... We're Sitting up close is... Derpy, and I can't wait to build a stand, because this is gonna bug me. Yeah, let's just build the stand. Like, I'm not gonna stop the video right now, but I will even... I will try, guys. This is just really bothersome, because I know that a little bit of the next level requires... Dude, just do a single jump. Why? Because it's clearly the double jump that's messing you up. Well, no. That's just game age being. Told you! Game? Why? Wow, that was. Like. Grr. You know, you're just gonna see me mess around because it's already like 10 minutes. I guess maybe we won't do this level this time. I'm not feeling it. All right, let's see. We're sitting about nine minutes, oh, 30 seconds. Oh, this one is a long level. It's a little bit of a long level, guys. Sorry to cut it a little bit short, but hey. Until next time, I'm Game Mage. I'm King of the Unlucky 13. Have a good one.